immortalize me. I want generations to see my beauty. You got it, lady. Green is my favorite color. Let's do this thing. Stay right there. You have got it. The first brush stroke is the most difficult. Hey, what's going on in here? Ah, get out! Shh, pretend I'm not here. Gotcha! Wait. That's it? Have you heard of minimalism? What are you talking about? Let me see it. Is… is that supposed to be me? What? Are you kidding? This guy's been on our wanted list for a while. I can explain. That's, uh, my brother. What? There's more. This is a fake mustache! I am shocked! Wanna see the worst part? Wait, Hazel? Don't act like you're surprised. Ladies, stop. There's only one thing for it. You're going downtown. No! I'm too rich for prison! Oh, you're not going to prison. I've got something better planned. You know, I quite like that painting. I'm taking this. For evidence. Sit right there. Let's take those cuffs off. I challenge you! So it's like that, is it? Ugh. What is he doing? Does this look okay? Anyway, this is your first challenge. Aw, a cute bunny. Ooh, art supplies. Let's get started. I've got a great idea. I just need to figure out how to work this pen. It's a tricky little thing. Ah. Wait. This is more like it. Next, I need a drinks cup. I'll draw a face on it. I'll start with the eyes. I wish my lashes looked this good. Now I'll draw a nose. Aw, it's looking cute! Next, I'll give it a happy smile. Then it's time for some rosy cheeks. This is looking good. But I'm not finished yet. This little guy is gonna need whiskers. There's still something missing. Every bunny needs ears. I'll need my scissors. I'll make cuts in the side of the cup. And then roll them up. Next, I'll apply glue to a soda bottle cap. And I'll stick another cap to it. Now I can wrap a rubber band around them. It's a little loose, so I'll use tape to hold it in place. This is just what I'm after. I'll place the rubber band over the cuts. And the caps go under the cup. All that's left to do is twist the rubber band. And when I let it go, this bunny hops! Woohoo! Look at it go! How am I supposed to beat that? Hmm, I've got an idea. I need to call daddy. Hello? Dad? I need your help. There was this cop and a bunny. I'm like totally stressed, daddy. Do something right now! Okay, thanks, daddy. Bye! Wow, that was fast. It's so exciting. I wonder what it is. There's only one way to find out. Wow, it's a robot. This is so cool. I knew dad wouldn't let me down. I can't wait to try it out. Hazel, get a load of this. This is gonna make my life so much easier. Okay, robot, do your thing. That's it. It's important to stretch. I want you to draw a rabbit. Wow, it's doing it. This is the best. I can just sit back and look good. The robot does it all. Wait. That's not right. It's a snail! Stupid robot! I want a rabbit! Got it? Are you listening to me? A rabbit. Come on. Ugh. This is why I have servants do everything. Okay, if you draw a rabbit, I'll give you a treat. That seems fair, right? So go for it. It's yours. Just give me the rabbit. I knew you'd have a sweet tooth. It just needed some persuasion. But I knew we'd get there in the end. You're done already? Are you kidding me? What's this supposed to be? This is starting to get annoying! What am I doing wrong? You could try it yourself. Time's up! And the winner is… Hazel! That was an easy decision. Yes! I knew it! This is the robot's fault! Wait, look. It's drawing something. Uh, police officer, here's my rabbit. It's cute, huh? No, it's over! I won! What do you want me to do? You're too late. Yes! Nah, nah, I'm the greatest! I'm telling daddy! Go ahead, I'm still the winner! I wonder what we've got this time. Sorry, this mustache takes a lot of work. Here's the next challenge. I can do that. Huh? What's this? Where's the pens? 
I think we're using buttons and string instead. This might be tricky. Uh, I don't do manual work. This isn't happening. Butler, get in here! You screamed, ma'am. I have the case. Behold. Freshly picked Pokeballs. Wow, are those golden? You've excelled yourself. I want a closer look. Wow, it's beautiful. You can go now. Let's see what's inside. Huh? That's it? It's so small! I was expecting more! Oh, it's so disappointing! What can you do? I just expected something more extravagant! Butler! What is this? Butler! Get over here now! You screeched, ma'am. Look at this! Ah, uh, I see the problem. One moment, ma'am. This is so embarrassing. I hope this is more suitable. What am I supposed to do with that? I believe the phrase is, work it. No! It needs to be bigger! I'll be right back. It's hard to get the staff these days. Tell me about it. Ta-da! Pikachu! Ah! How's that? I loved it! Do it again! That was pretty good! I'm so happy! You suit this color! Thank you, ma'am. Whatever. I can beat that. Hold on. I think I know what to do! I don't need this. I've got my socks. I always have a spare. It's the perfect color. Let's do this. I'll start by making some alterations. I'll cut the sock into two. I'll go right down the middle. I'll cut one half into small pieces. Just like this. I'll start arranging the pieces. I want it to look like Pikachu. Not bad. Now I need to sew it together. I'll make sure the thread is nice and tight. I'll attach the arms and legs. It's starting to take shape. But I need to stuff it. That's more like it. It still needs some work, though. I'll use black felt for the eyes. I've just cut out two circles. I'll stick them in place. And then put two white buttons on them. Pikachu has red cheeks. So I'll use red buttons for them. Next, I need a marker pen. Don't move! I want to draw a nose. And your mouth, of course. I can use the pen to color the ears as well. I'll only do the top part. I think it's ready! My own cuddly Pikachu! It looks great! It's so soft! What do you think? You'd never know it was a sock! Is that what the smell is? Ugh, no way! Yeah, that's pretty bad. What? I washed them last week! It's my own unique scent. Ah, cheesy. I can still smell it. Achoo! Ugh. Look what you've done! Oops, sorry. It's burning my nostrils. Shall we get on with the judging? Wait, what is that? It… it smells delightful! Ah, jeez. My favorite. I love it! Finally, someone with good taste. Hazel wins again. Great job! Woohoo! We did it, Pikachu! I don't understand this challenge! Haha, <laughs> better luck next time! I'll never get rid of that smell! Can we hurry up? I've got a manicure appointment. Okay, let's go. Here's the next one. It's a tiger! Okay, I've got this. That's all we get? Seriously? Nope, I'm not using those. Butler! What is it now? I want a tiger. A tiger? Bud? Go, and be quick. Of course, ma'am. Good luck! I need a few things, too. I hate taking out the trash. I'll take that! What the… Huh? This is just what I'm after. Let's have a look. This is so tragic. Hey, it's good to recycle. I need this toilet paper tube. I'll flatten it. Then I'll start to draw on it. I want to create a tiger. I have to concentrate. I need this to be perfect. Okay, now it's time to cut it out. Then it's time to add colors. I'll start with the orange pen. I want to cover it completely. 
Then I can add the stripes. This is gonna be one friendly tiger. I'll do three stripes on the back. Then add some to the legs. So far so good! That's the body done! Next, I need to draw the face. I'll do that on the inside and then fold it over. Aww, I love it! Look at this, Lexi! It's good, huh? Rawr, rawr! Rawr! <laughs> Call that a tiger? Just you wait. I prefer the real thing. What's taking so long? Sorry, ma'am. Uh, the tiger. It got loose. I tried to stop it, but, well, I don't want to talk about it. Can't you do anything right? Are you okay? No. Give me that! Get out of here! I'm sorry, ma'am. <gasps> Can I buy your tiger? Please? You want this? Yeah, hand it over. Nope. It's mine. This is worth more than money. Ugh! I guess I'm gonna have to draw something. How hard can it be? It's just an angry kitty. There, that should do it. Here you go. I hope you like it. Ugh, I'm trying not to look at Lexi's. Hazel wins. Not again! <laughs> I'm ready for the next round. I hope you like rainbows. They make me so happy. They're okay, I suppose. Yeah, I guess they are. Ooh, look at this! I got lipstick! This is awesome! Wow, I love this shade! I could use a touch-up. What do you think? I'd rather not say… Please don't do that again. Anyway, I have a great idea. I'll remove my eyeshadow. I'll need two brushes. And my makeup. I'll dip the brushes into the makeup. Now I'll apply it. At the same time. It gives a great effect. I'll add some color to my lips. This is better than boring old lipstick. I can't forget about the mascara. I must have gorgeous lashes. This will give it a little sparkle. I love it. I know. I look amazing. But I'm not finished. I've got this canvas. I'll press my face into it. Ta-da! Now that is a work of art. It should be in a gallery. Wow! Hang on. There's something stuck in my teeth. Hmm. It must be lunch. Give me a second. Ugh, I can't get it out. Oh, I know. I should floss more often. Luckily, I've got my laces. Get out of there! Huh? What are you doing? Wait. Is that blood? Ah, it's the lipstick! Hmm, maybe I can use this. I just need a few more colors. You're gonna like this. I'll apply the makeup to the lace. I'll do the same on the other side. Now I've got a multicolored lace. It looks amazing! Now I need to create art. Where's my notebook? Ah, here it is. I'll open it up. And I'll put the lace on it. I'll arrange it in a wave pattern. Then I'll close the notebook over, I'll put my hand on it, then I'll pull the lace out. It's that easy. When I open the notebook, I've got a piece of art. I can stare at this all day. Huh? I'm finished! It's nice, huh? Wait, are my teeth clean? <sighs> this is so annoying. Don't mind me. Ah, <sighs> that feels good. That could have been embarrassing. Come on, pick me. They both look good. I'm impressed. You're both winners. You deserve it. Yes, I knew it. Although, I'm not sure about Hazel's picture. Just ignore her. Mmm, this popcorn is so tasty. Where are my manners? Thanks, Matthew. Catch! Oh. Incoming! Good shot! Heads up! What? Hey, that looks suits you! Oh my gosh, this is so funny! What's going on? Hey, I'm a bird! I love it! You look so soft and cuddly! Uh, guys, we're still doing the challenge! Oops, I forgot about that. Next up, we've got an adorable little chick! No problem! Ooh, there's some popcorn left. Hmm, maybe I can use the kernels. I'll sprinkle them onto the paper. 
I've added some glue to it. And when I shake off the excess kernels, I'm left with this chick. Wow, that's a great idea. I'll use this gold bar. I keep it handy for emergencies. I'll shred it onto the paper. Wait, you have gold? Who are you? I'm done with that. I've got a little golden chick. Look at him shine. It does look cute. It's over to you, Lily. Hmm, this is a tough one. They're both similar. Although one is made out of precious metal, and the other is pretty basic. You know what? It's a tie. Congratulations! Woohoo! That seems fair. Okay, are you ready for this one? I'm so excited! <laughs> that is nice! Aw, let's see some drafts. <laughs> hmm, how do I do it? Oh, that's a piece of cake. I could do it in my sleep. <gasps> <sighs> if you say so. Hmm, I know. Start with a head like this. A sort of swoop line. Now just a few more lines. Hmm. Got it! Just a quick snack first. Mmm! Then a nap. So fresh! Phew! That mole was huge! I'm glad to be back, though. But I got the inspiration I needed. Time to get to work! First, draw these four numbers. One. Two, three, and four in a square. We'll start with the giraffe. This one will be his neck and front leg. Then we add his head and ears and tail. Can't forget the spots. Aw, look at this little guy. And now for number two. And here's a swan. What should I do for three? Wings, of course. A beautiful butterfly! It's time for number four. Look at those scales! And lastly, a fish. They're all so cute! Now it's time to color them all in. Drafts are yellow, of course. And then with darker spots. He's cute, right? Swans are white or gray. Or sometimes black. And this one is super elegant. Don't forget the water. That'll be blue, of course. An orange butterfly? Why not? It'll be pretty. Adorable! It's all about the little details. Can't forget the spots. Now, onto the little fish. I'll make him blue, green, and yellow. With pink lips. Done! All right, time's up, girls. Okay. Oh no! I drew four animals. Including the giraffe, of course. Wow! Incredible, Ashley! Good! Luna? Just one more second, okay? I can't draw fast enough. This will have to work, I guess. Done. I ran out of time. Oh. That is. Uh, interesting. At least he has a nice head, right? What a sad <laughs> excuse for a draft. It's mm -hmm. my turn! Look at it go! Huh? That seems okay. Ooh! Not again. Okay, fine. No peeking! I love this part. What happened? Where's the paint? There's no paintbrushes. Maybe I can help. I always come prepared. Hold this. Uh, okay. I never knew you played. This won't do. Do you always carry this around with you? 
How about this? Hmm. Nah. Leo, what do you have in there? Aha! This might be useful. Really? We can definitely use this. Let's get set up. Mm-hmm. I'll put some paint onto the canvas. That should do it. Now for the toothbrush. I'll brush the paint into a feather pattern. The colors are merging! That looks great! Huh? Uh, uh, Leo! Put the brush down! Trust me! Actually, that's pretty nice. Ugh. I think I need to freshen up. Leo! Don't! My breath is so bad. Uh, I'm not sure that's a good idea. <laughs> How do I look? Well, uh, I'd rather not say. At least the painting is finished. <laughs> wow! I love it! Don't look in a mirror. Huh? I tried to tell you. Do I have something on my teeth? I might have made a mistake. Oh look! It's our next challenge! Huh. That's just spinning and spinning. What now? Oh, look. Now there's a button here. I guess we're supposed to press it. Wait! Stop! Don't press it yet! We should press it together at the same time! Ugh. Come on, let's press it. Okay, it's still spinning. When's it gonna stop? Maybe I'll press it again. Wait, wait, wait. Let it go a bit longer. Just a bit more. A little bit more. Keep going. Here it comes. One. Two. Three. Now! So now it's stopped. And we don't win anything? Seems likely. I don't even know where to start with this one. There's gotta be something that can help me out. Oh wait! Right, I have this picture! That could maybe help. And then I'll use Cheryl's frog drawing too! <laughs> Unfortunately, I'm gonna have to erase this frog in the picture. But sacrifices need to be made for art! There we go! <gasps> what the? Hey! That's my frog drawing! Yeah, well, sorry, but it's what I need to do. And now that the frog is erased, I've got this blank folded paper. So I can start my own drawing of blue. Gotta have his crown, and big eyes, and of course his mouth. And definitely can't forget his bit of drool. Next up, time to open the folded paper. So now I can continue to finish my drawings. I've gotta complete these two halves of Blue's head. I kinda want it to look a little gross and scary. That's the point of these characters. There we go. I've sketched it all out with pencil. So now it's time to outline it with my black marker. I want to make sure that it's all covered so I can start coloring. Just a little more, and… good! Now let me fill in his eyes. I can just use the same black marker like I did for the outline. Gotta get the mouth and eye over on the right side, too. Next up, some blue! Because his name is Blue, after all. And when I've finished with the blue, I can do his golden crown. Because he's not the blue we all know if he doesn't have his crown. Got brown for his hair. And now a bit of a redder brown for his tongue. And then also the squishy inside of the right side of blue. Can't forget the stretchy bits, too. So gross. And finally, I'll use a much lighter pink to finish it up. Almost done! Next, a light orange for the skin tone of the inside guy. Last step, let's make that drool a dark blue. This looks great! I think I'm finally done with the drawing! <laughs> so cool and creepy! Oh man, I'm so happy with how this turned out! This might be the best creation I've ever made! Huh? Hey Cheryl, I made you this drawing! Huh? Oh yeah, that's not a bad drawing! Ah! Holy <laughs> cow, you scared me so bad! I can't believe you made that! You're such a weirdo! I'm out of here! Outside blue, inside blue! Outside blue, inside blue! Outside, inside! Outside, inside! Uh, Cheryl, can't you see I'm busy? Ah! You're not Cheryl! You're blue! I've gotta run! Huh, that was way too easy. But she did scare me first. I better get ready for the next challenge. This seems like the right time. Stacy, this is for you. I hope you like them. Uh-huh. Are you serious? No, I can't. Ew, a gift for me? Nope. It's for Stacy. Really? I wonder what it is. Aw, look at it! What? It's just a stupid unicorn. I'll never understand women. 
Aw, it's from my crush! He's the best. I'll treasure this forever. That gives me an idea for the next round. A unicorn. Are you joking? Fine, let's do this. Nope. This isn't going well. It's so soft! Ooh, there's something else in the box. Is that candy? It sure smells like candy. Mmm, it's yummy. Huh? What's happening? Wait a second. I think I've got it! It's time to draw. I'll draw the outline of the unicorn on graph paper. Then I'll go around the outline. Trust me, this'll be good. Next, I'll start to add some details. This'll be the hair. Now I fill in the outline. It makes it stand out. Now I'll add the color. It's gonna look so pretty. I just need to make sure I stay inside the lines. I'll make the horn multicolored. That's good. I'll add the finishing touches. All done! Lily, I'm finished! Time is running out! What? How? What am I gonna do? <sighs> This'll have to do. Uh, ta-da! Uh, at least you tried. Well done, Stacy. It looks great. The less I say, the better, Matthew. Stacy wins. There's no contest. Yeah, I know. Woohoo! I knew it. What do you think we'll get next? All right, you two. Are you ready? It looks like your selection this time is boy. I'm interested to see what you come up with. Hmm. I'm kind of bummed about this one. Not gonna lie. Huh? Oh no! I'm out of snacks. Now that's something to be bummed about. Well, now what am I gonna do? Hang on a second. I've got this empty plate now. Yep, this is totally gonna work. I've got a great plan. What are you even doing over there with that plate and marker? I don't get it. Why are you drawing on the plate like that? Don't worry about me. I know what I'm doing. Gonna just finish up my little stick man on this plate. Hmm, boy. What should I draw for that? I'll try with my words again. That seems to work well for me. Okay, there we go. Boy, now it's time to transform it. Give him some glasses and now some hair. Looking good. Can't forget your ear, though. Or his chin, nose, and mouth. All right, I've got my stick man. I think he needs a balloon, too. There. And he needs a string so the balloon doesn't fly away. Ugh. There's something in my teeth. It's obnoxious. No good. Maybe something to drink will help. Gulp. Hmm. Maybe a little better, I think. I think you need some orange hair. Just a little bit more and your hair will be good to go. All right. You want a green shirt? Sure thing. I'm done! <gasps> no! You spilled water all over my guy! He's drowning! I have to do something to save him! No, no, no! Stickman, don't panic! Wait. Something's happening! Something's going on with my stickman! You're right! He can't drown because it floats! He's so cool! I love him! You did a great job! I win this one? No way! That's amazing! What do we have now? Ah! What the heck? That frog jumped right out at us! No, 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 I'm totally freaked out by frog! Wow, that's a real-life frog. He looks kinda cute, actually. Maybe I'll just give him a little pet on his head. Aw, he's so nice. What a great little frog. Ashley, what are you doing? Don't touch that! Ew, I don't like it. Not one bit. Well, that's too bad for you. It's time for me to get a drawing. Time to create a great work of art about this little frog. I can't believe you're not even creeped out by this frog. Ah, no! It's looking at me again! I hate this! Wait a second. Maybe this is a way I can handle this horrifying situation. Yep, this is totally going to work. I've got these folds in the paper. I'll start by drawing his big, bulgy, creepy eyes. And now I need to draw his little froggy feet. So gross that they're webbed. He needs a big, gulpy frog mouth. And now I can start coloring him in. I'll use green. It's a classic frog color. Color in his face and now down to the bottom of his body. Whew. This is taking kind of a long time. A lot of green. Phew. Finally finished with all the froggy green. But of course, I can't forget his mouth. Time for some red. And then some more red. He needs a tongue, though. This little strip of fabric will work nicely now that it's glued down. I just need to finish this little slice in the paper. Uh-oh. Here comes a bug. I'll attach it to a string and thread it through the slice in the paper. And now to close up my froggy's mouth. 
I'm done! What do you think of this frog? My drawing is much cuter than yours. And watch! He's gonna gulp down the fly! Wow! I can't believe you made that, Cheryl! That's so clever! My drawing barely even looks like a frog now that I look at it. <sighs> oh, wow. Ashley's frog drawing is kind of… not great. <sighs> yeah, this drawing is pretty much a complete failure. Hey, wait a second. I think I might know what to do! Froggy, I'm gonna need your help for this next step. Ooh, I hope this works! Oh my gosh! It did work! Oh, flowers! For me? I can't believe you brought these! What the heck? Now Ashley has a prince and flowers? I'm so glad you kissed me. I was tired of being a frog. Hey, wake up! You're daydreaming or something! Ugh. Why are you holding the frog? Are you gonna kiss it? What? Uh, no. I, I wasn't gonna kiss the frog. No. Bored, are we? Well then, it's time for the next challenge! Poppy playtime characters? Oh, I can handle that because I've still got my trusty pancake batter. Alright, back to my batter art. The yellow outline is done, so let me use this red next. Even when you just have a shape, you still have to outline it. Because that's how you fill it in. Just like I'm doing now. Otherwise, the batter would go everywhere. And we don't want that because it would not make a picture. Just a big, colorful, battery mess. Next up, time for the eyes. I'll start with little dots of black. And then I'll need the green dots above and below, too. It's looking great! Now it needs to cook for a bit. It's almost like a real pancake! Okay, he's set. So time to flip him over. Just a little flip and good! There we go. He's fully cooked and done. Oh wow! I love how he turned out! And Betty! Oh! I don't want to tip the waiter. What the? Hey! Wake up! Huh? What? I'm awake? Hey! When did he have time to finish that? Go on, Jeeves, shoo! I need to do better than Liam. All right, 3D pen. We're back at it. Let's make some art. As usual, I'll start with a black outline. Okay, I've got the eyes. Let me fill them in. Now we can add some color and then start filling in the rest. Now I'll switch to purple and then to pink. And some red. And then a little bit of white on top. And my PJ Pugapillar is complete! He's so cute! And here's my entry for this challenge. It's clearly the best. Whatever. It's not so great. Bunzo Bunny is where it's at. Oh, um… I choose Liam! That's right, Betty! Looks like I'm the winner again! Ugh. Ugh. Whoa! It took me forever to find you! Oh, it stinks in here. What the heck are you doing? I'm in the bathroom here! Well, I have the next challenge for you. Uh, I'm listening. I want you to draw a snake for me. Okay, I think I can handle that. Any questions for me? No, I don't have any questions! Are you sure? Jeez, come on! Fine! I can't believe this happened. All I wanted was some privacy. Ridiculous. Wait a second. I've got this toilet paper. And a marker. Snake time! Whoa! Oh, there you are. I've been looking for you. Um, yeah, I'm right here. Trying to do some work. Anyway, I need you to draw me a snake. Okay, yeah, I can handle that. Okay, here's your timer. Get drawing that snake! Ugh, I've gotta start drawing! It's just a snake. That can't be too hard to draw, right? Wow, that is… a long snake. Here's my snake. Look at how wiggly he is. Are you kidding me? It's on toilet paper! No! What do you have for a drawing? Perfect timing because I just finished. Here it is! Oh, oh my gosh! I thought it was real for a second there! One point for you! Yes! I got my first point! Now we're tied! Well, whatever. Maybe I can finally get out of this bathroom. Did you hear that? I'm finally out! All right, I have to go! Hey, Gabby, check out my snake! She totally hated it! Really? Because it's such a great snake! I love it! You totally deserve the win! How did you do it? Actually, I can show you! Okay, you want to start with a little oval at the top. And then draw a wavy line from there down. Then double it up, but before you reach the end. Next, you're gonna want to fill out the other side of the line, too. Okay, next we'll want to erase that center line and draw the outline with a pen. This is by far the easiest part of the drawing. 
There we go. Next, we want to add lines around all the inside curves. Then add some more lines. That's the underneath of the snake. Don't forget to add eyes and nostrils for our slithery friend, too. Now we can start adding pencil for shading. Darker on the edges and then fading to white in the middle. Oh, I see. Wow, Gabby. So cool. High five! All right, my dear peasants. You'll stop talking soon. Once you see these royal jewels… So shiny! Draw it! I have this one in the bag! Drawing a crown's so easy. Even a monkey could do it. Oh, really? I'll show her how it's really done. It's all about the little details. And next, we move on to the jewels. Ruby red coming right up! But I could use a little realism. Good thing I never go anywhere without this thing. It's perfect! But it could use a little sparkle! Gold sparkle, of course! Don't worry, I have a plan! Let's go! You first! Alrighty! What do you think? It's so pretty, you can wear it! How did you do that? I love it! And now for yours, Ashley! Here's my crown! A little underwhelming, but this ought to help you out. Um, I don't know if I like this. <laughs> We hope that challenge inspired you to produce your own masterpiece. Who created the best art? Lexi or Hazel? Let us know in the comments below. Remember to share this video with your friends and don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more great videos just like this one!